Yeah, we're here at DeVry College of New York. It's uh, February 27, 2013, and we're here with Adam, Ed, and Cesar. Uh, and they made this uh, device. Uh, so can, why don't you tell me what this device is about? Well, the overall purpose of this device is that we want to try to find different ways of controlling um, a mouse on a computer. Okay. Say for like people who um, don't have like their hands or, you know, you know, Basically, they can't use the mouse convention. For, so someone who's disabled or exactly. has a problem or amputees, with amputees, quadriplegics. So they can control a computer mouse using facial expressions. Yes. Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah. Okay. So w what what makes that work? Do you use electrodes? Or what do you yeah. Connect well, the main, the, you know, the gist of it is basically we use electromyography signals, okay. which we get by, um, this is an example of the prototype circuit that we got. Okay. So basically with this whole array, we're able to amplify the small signals mm -hmm. that our muscles create when I'm flexing, you know, because okay. whenever the muscles contract and flex, right. there's actually these small micro volts. Okay, okay. Uh, so can, can you so look at those electrodes? Uh, and basically once the electrodes collect that information, it's amplified, mm -hmm. it goes into our... Okay. So what, what are these circuits order. here? That's the amplification circuit? Yes, correct. Okay. And so, uh, and that, those signals go into this board. board. Which is going to send it to the program. Yeah, what is program. that board? The Arduino Uno. Okay, yeah. so that's like a microprocessor, microcontroller? Well, essentially, it's, a, it's mainly an A to D. The okay. good, good thing about this is that everything is, is flashed in the embedded chip. Yeah. Okay. okay. So the whole purpose is that instead of having a different program into the mm -hmm. computer right. to like act as, you know, to, to act as the mouse, we just use original mouse drivers. So right. when you plug this chip in via USB, it doesn't uh -huh. see the Arduino. Oh. It thinks it's, it's a, a mouse. mouse. It thinks it's a yeah. mouse. Wow. That way, it just plugs in, and you can use it in any So computer. this is connected to the computer. Yes. Correct. So, so it doesn't matter what application on the computer you're nope. using. No. no. So nope. it just it could be so takes over. Oh, well, it could be any, any anything. anything. Oh, wow. It does not matter. So could we take a look at uh, how it works? So. Uh, okay, definitely. So, so basically, as you, we're demonstrating stuff one at a time. So we have one electrode hooked up here to his okay. chin muscle. Uh -huh. So this could actually generate particular movements. Okay. So when he flexes, uh, just just flex, and we'll show on the screen later. Okay, so that's wow. a flex here. And then, now, when you focus here on the uh, on the screen, you should move it up. Or I don't know, maybe it's better on this one. Yeah. 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 So, so when you flex, oh, it's there. So, so that movement is from from his face. Yes. yes. Exactly. So it's facial. Um, so hands free. I'll make it go back okay. down. Okay. Yeah. Now you can make it go back down. Wow. That's, that's all from his facial muscles. Awesome. Wow. Okay. Okay. So what can be some future extension? Like this looks like a very very good project for someone who's disabled. You know, or an what what other uh, modifications of future work well, would be done? There's two um, primary modifications that would make this better. Um, with a bigger budget, we could have got better electrodes. The better electrodes would be more um, discreet, so you're not like sticking like all these pads on your face. Oh, okay. And we're even thinking of having a pair of glasses, like a headset, yeah. that you could actually put on, so you know it's a lot more compact and it's right. easy for someone to take on and off instead of having exactly. to stick on electrodes. It has the contact, pads. so it's very easy. Pretty much, also what we did was this was. Instead of having four of these chips, mm -hmm. you would technically need four of these. Four so of you, those, okay. You shrunk it down. So you shrunk it down into that. Okay. And one for like front, yeah. back, left, right. Okay. Yes, exactly. Oh, this is really good work. And uh, once again, I want to congratulate you guys on building this project. Thank you. And I want to wish you good luck in the future. Thank, Thank you. you. Hopefully this can